I don't know exactly what color that is, but I like it. After watching numerous uh, vlogs about this place, I decided since our hotel is only like 15 minutes away, I would come see the place and you know see if I could get you know a souvenir for the kids or something. Anyway, we are at Theme Park Connection, but we're gonna go in, check it out, see what they got. So this is Theme Park Connection. 1985 Cabernet Sauvignon. It's a hat signed by Johnny Depp. There's boxes of cast member name tags. I might try to find some for the kids. Oh, they play it. That's 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 my jam. <laughs> Now that I'm recording, authentic screen use props from the Hunger Games. So this was the pod or something. I don't know what. I don't remember seeing in the movie where that would have been. And my friend says those missiles over there are also from the Hunger Games. More props from the Hunger Games. There's Hollywood Studios 25th anniversary banner. Is this a part of the ride? Hey, I think this is a door from Pooh's Adventure or whatever. The giant safe door. Oh, these are scrims. These are construction scrims. Look. Pretty cool. I want this in my house. It lights up also. That could be a brand new. You just got LED lights. Yeah, it's got lights and stuff. It's got figures. Marching it's got, band. It's got everything. Yeah. The lights, oh. we don't have it all hooked up because there's like a bajillion yeah. wires yeah. and stuff below. Good grief. It's even got the floral thing. It's got the original signage. Imagine having the patience to make this kind of thing. <laughs> Partners. Second beauty castle. Buttons, any kind of button you want or need. First visits. Anniversaries. Just buckets of them. But you, you can't like run your hand through it looking for them because some of them are open and that would hurt. Sugar glass breakaway movie props from the Lone Ranger. All that you break it not cut you. Alright now these are this is signage and stuff that uh, was used in the hotels before they were remodeled. So this stuff at one time was in one of the hotels. This is an exterior window, Sir Mickey's merchandise shop from Fantasyland. Giant window. And it shows you where it was in the park. These are blueprints. This is the Backlot Stunt Show. October 99, this this whole booklet of this European blueprints, Disneyland. 700, Euro Disneyland, which is now Disneyland Paris. How much, like what is that, like that one sheet you've got right there, how much this is that? This one's only 500. That's the Adventureland juice bar. This one's 700. No, that's for, $5, that's for, 700, for that's, a, that's a whole Vista. booklet. Wow. That's for the All-Star Resort. Look, that's yeah. for the All-Star Resort. Stamp 93. Yeah, that's when it was built. Well, it was built a little bit later than that, but it's... What does that say behind it? Res that's not restricted. Yeah. Or received. Received. February 15th, yeah. 1993. What is this a blueprint of? I don't, I don't want to unfold anything. It's that all this stuff, the, the pages are all yellowed. This is the Harbor Cantina at Euro Disneyland. Mickey hats of all shapes and sizes. Any type of lanyard you want. There's like a plaque, it's like thank you. 
from the entire cast of Walt Disney World. Thank you, Julie Bidwell, for 10 years of outstanding service helping to keep the name of Walt Disney the finest in family home entertainment. Or family entertainment, family home entertainment. Well, it was like, and it just goes on and on. Die cast of all different types. Now here's a piece of the actual stock car with Theme Park Connections logo and a race suit with Reed Torrington's name. Wait a minute. I could get $3 for my NASCAR cup? Okay, this is the deluxe masterpiece home edition of Cinderella VHS. Various old magazines. Let's see, that's 88. Here's a letter from Mickey Mouse at the 20th anniversary of uh, Disney World, which would have been 25 years ago. This is Disney. Wait, okay, so say what this is again. This is the stockholder book stock for Disneyland. Book for Disneyland. Dated, it's, does it get any dates on it? It's all in the, it looks like 80s. $500. It's early to mid 80s. It's all the lawsuits they won. Okay, before I was so rudely interrupted by a lack of memory in my iPhone, we found tons of documents. There are documents here like shareholders information, uh, 1990 capital asset request, Magic Kingdom operations guides. Uh, here's a member guidebook for the, the vacation club. All kinds of very interesting documents and stuff I would just love to peruse through if we had the time. Here's a history and price guide. Okay, while you're holding that, thank you for holding that. Um, these are keys and everything for resorts. And like, look at, that's all some of the original, the original Walt Disney World logo is 89. This is all information This is amazing. Uh, that's a 1983 document there. This is employment information. Employee, employee, are those like? Yeah, it's like the original employees. Some of them are in here. So this is a cast member guide, but like files? Know. Are these like yeah, these are, these are files. This is like picture of the people. And then they're and their, their work employment, their general employment history, uh -huh. professional affiliations. This is amazing. And they're, it's their evaluations. That's Marital what it is. Marital status, children. It's their evaluation forms. That's what it is. Look at that guy. That's a cast member right there. Dedicated and dependable. Usually takes some thought. Excellent detail and follow through person. This is uh, Mary Alice Ford. I say WDW employment history, 78 to 80, wardrobe hostess. Wow. Check out, uh, let's see, who's this? This is Thomas Limble. He's the manager of costume. Manager of costume issue. Good, good. And he worked at Disneyland first. Check out the bottom of that, that list. Mm -hmm. Well, I was going to see if I could find a name tag for one of my kids, but I can't find his name. It's a fairly common name, and you would think it would be in here, but I cannot find it, and I won't dig around too much because there are needles. Needles. Like, well, I tried. I could, I could find none of our names. I am sorry. I have failed my children. Main Street USA Planter. So that was in 2014 they sponsored the 36. In Park Connection. So if you're ever in Orlando, it's in a warehousey type area, but it's uh, very, I could spend days in here looking at all the old stuff. They have like pins from 2000, the 20th anniversary pins, which I, I'm gonna buy one. <laughs> so here and outside they have a box for an Imperial Probe droid. Level five clearance required. I do not have that level of clearance, so we will go. Okay, so I am back here at Disney Springs. 
Um, we're going to try to catch the drone show tonight. So, or I'm going to try to catch it. I'm alone tonight. So, um, try to catch it, film a little bit of it, as much as this camera can hold, because you know it. It's a horrible camera. Or phone. And all that big long intro, you guys couldn't have told me that I forgot my hat. Appreciate that. By the way, I named it the Alls Park. Didn't notice this until just now, but it, we looked at it last night and everything else. That entire building is made out of glass. Like, it's a building encased in glass. Yeah, boy, you know. Holy moly, check out that sunset. I'm gonna run in the balloon tonight. Nope. Someone's a genius. When you ask for top shelf liquor in that place, you are giving the bartender a challenge. Just walking through here, I'm going to be in a lot of family Instagrams. It's going to be popular. Santa. I know that guy. That is amazing. So that was the show. Um, if you want to see, if you want to see the whole show, it's all over YouTube. I mean, at much better angles than I had with a much better camera. So, but yeah, very it, amazing technology. You know, Disney at its best.